Hello everyone, welcome to Ignition. Hello and welcome back again to our future vehicle competition yep. of year 2020. 2020 now, is an interesting year actually for cars, isn't it? There is it, plenty. It, it's an interesting year, full stop. Very true, it's not just the cars, but we won't get into that. Boring. In the last episode, we pulled out our cars. I pulled out the Rivian RT, R1T, sorry, Rivian R1T. And I pulled out a Bentley Speed 6 EV. EV. Whoa. EV. Now, I think this could be our closest battle yet. You reckon? Yeah. Well, there are the rules. Have a look at those. Oh, I'm going to scratch my ear and hole. And here are the two. I, I notice on screen I scratch a lot. Because yeah, I am the only person who watches myself. You, you do a lot more than just scratch, mm. but we won't go into that either. <laughs> both. And that's at both of them. Mm. So... Very different wow. cars here, very different cars, but they're both lovely. This to, like you say, I suppose this could be your favourite lineup. If you were both of them parked outside, you'd be... That's a perfect uh, combo. Yeah, it just is, isn't it? So, I think, I, I think I'd take the Rivian over the Bollinger. Oh yeah, so would I. The, that Rivian is sexy. That is sexy. Uh, it's, it's grown on me more. When I first saw it, I thought, oh, the front's a bit weird, mm. which it is. It's sort of got nostrils. But I really have. It's, I've watched so many videos on that. I'm becoming obsessed it's by It's very it. well designed. But very do I well like a Bentley? Oh, you love a Bentley. I like a Bentley. You do like and a Bentley. And I don't like... I mean, that's a Bentley. Yeah. I mean, that, if you're comparing that to the sort of 06, 07 GT, it's totally different, isn't it? Do you reckon that... Um, which six is lit up. The six, yes, I think it is in the grill. I thought it looked a bit like a turbo from here, but obviously it's electric, but I thought... It... I watched a Rory Reid review of the big Continental and the grill was all chromed plastic right. and it was all moving, which I thought was a little bit nasty because I remember touching Bentley's um, 10, 15 years ago. The grills were lovely. Yes. In fact, one of, the, one of our customers back in the day made grills for Bentleys and Range Rovers. I had a Range Rover one, didn't I, mm. at work? Yes. And they were beautiful, just um, sculptured pieces of wire TIG welded together. They were beautiful. Mm. And that looks quite nice. It does. The, current, the new Bentley is cheap plastic, but I'm assuming it's for crashes and hitting people and yes, things like that. Yes, that's true. But that is one seriously stunning car. It is, and the lights are interesting. They're sort of like crystal balls, aren't they? Oh, it's Bentley? just... Uh, oh, oh. So we've got to make our verdict. What are we going we to have, and this verdict? could be really boring because I am so stuffed. I, I, you know, sometimes I need to lie down and think about it. Yeah. Well, I think I know which one I'm having. If I had to have one parked outside for my <sighs> daily usage, I know which one I'd be having. This is this is this competition. Considering no one watches it, yeah. except about three people, mm. which we do very, very, very much appreciate. Yes. I am really stuffed on this one. Because the Rivian would suit where we live, Portugal, and what we do vastly better, but I want that Bentley so bad it almost hurts. Mm. So I've made my decision. I've made mine. Right, you ready? Which one's going through? In three, two, one. Bentley. Bentley. Really? Yeah, I've, I, 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 you just, you know, the Bentley is just. Wow, because I love that Rivian. And it's, it's. Oh, the Rivian is a spectacular car. I mean, and for what we do. Oh. We'd be better off with that Rivian. Oh, yeah, but yeah, it's yeah, just yeah, 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 yeah. But the other thing I would say is that I change my mind about a car every day, don't I? Mm -hmm. Not even every day. That's stupid. It's three or four times a day, isn't it? Yes, every couple of hours you change. I've wanted that Rivian. for. If, if I won the lottery, which would be hard because I don't do it, mm -hmm. I think... I think I'd order a Rivian as part of not my only car. No, but I think that would become my daily driver over a Defender, which is in our lottery winners garage. Yes, I just love that Rivian. We're going to have to redo that lottery's winners we garage because yes. I've complete those two are going in mine. I think. Yeah, comment down below if you want us to do the uh, lottery winners again. Yeah, all one of you. Yeah, all one of you, Steve Doswell. Yeah, please, <laughs> Steve. We love you. Yeah, we do. We do. We, we love you. We do because you're nice and you. Yeah, you yeah, you don't roast us. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, so get your sack out. Oh God, sorry. I'm so you, I'm still miffed that the Rivian's gone out because the I Rivian thought, really didn't deserve to go out there. I thought that was again a potential winner of this comp. Oh, yeah. oh but then your sack's feeling a bit empty. My sack is. Oh, hello. Oh, my sack. We're going to be going to round two. I've pulled out. Oh! 
very odd name. I've pulled out a Hyundai Tarlac. Oh, even I don't know what that is. Hyundai Tarlac. And it's going up against the Tesla Cybertruck. Ooh. Now, ooh. I hate that. I like it. Mm, yeah. So let's see what happens. Yes, in the next one. Thanks for watching. I'm sorry about that Rivian going out because I think if people were going to comment, I think as a future vehicle, the Rivian is better than the Bentley. Yes, to a degree. But anyway, just, we're carrying on now because yeah. we're, we're going to chat about this for a while. So we'll turn Catch the camera in the next off. one. And I need a poo. <laughs>